<laughs> oh my god, literally. BV, yeah. Barista vibes. All hero means are Baristas, because I'm also Barista. So, going over against the Snake versus Hero matchup, this is something that uh, definitely best character in BB's arsenal to go against someone uh, like Bobo, especially Snake. You have your Flector and your and basically bounce. You have bounce. And you also have your standing your standing shield um, if you're standing, crouching, or uh, walking. So, you have Southern active, and you're just avoiding everything that Bobo is throwing out as, uh, as you should, because you don't want to get hit by any of these. Uh, oh my Bobo. god, he's saying Bobo can't use a Bobo mean snake. Nope. This is nobody knows. Nobody there he knows. Uh, nobody knows, ready to make some trouble. Bounce online though, so the grenade tosses will be reflected, but the actual explosions themselves will not be. Will not be yeah. Yeah, 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 so you gotta reflect the grenade before it explodes. Yes, um, sir. For it to go back on, nobody knows. Yeah, so Not bad, nobody knows. Yeah, fiending, fiending is just the buff type of game plan, like Bounce Accelerado, getting a ton, uh, getting much more off grabs than Lucario does at a uh, wider range of percents, as well as having access to kill throw. Yep. Uh, is going with Psych Up, or sometimes without if you or have patience. If it's like at like 170, <laughs> you'll get your, your back throw kill throw. Yeah, it's, if you're patient. If you're patient. <laughs> you really want Psych Up to kill like 120 with the oh, up yeah. throw. That's what you really want. But that Zappo is going to be really good um, as well. Just keep a little bit more, pa a little bit of that uh, Game. distance from the body nose as well. Just going, uh, having back and forth between all these uh, all these projectiles that nobody knows is throwing out. Yeah, very, very careful game plan, but something that Vivi does on either side is the runoff B reverse off the platform into charge sword cancel grab, which yeah. is just so clean every time you watch it. But it is also a very imp important mix up when you have tools like the uh, like the frizz line, which are just such flexible projectiles. But nobody knows has been playing very. He's been very reactive and very much on the draw, finding the up tilt there as Vivi gives him the draw that they want, yep. but it's it's been buff farming season for Vivi as a play, and I mean, you're looking, you see what he's looking for, he's looking for these bounces, he's, they're looking for uh, psych ups, oomphs, etc. Yeah, this is the psych up up tilt or up throw that you're really well looking for as hero oh. um, against uh, nobody or just, uh, or just in general, really. Uh, so right now, I think we are glowing like Christmas. We got oomph active, a little sparkles as oomph. We got green, a solid water, and we got a little bit, I believe, a psych up. No, it's like it's yeah. gone by now. Yeah, psych up. There was psych up. Well, psych up's back now. Psych up oomph uh, does make forward tilt one two a shield break, but yep. didn't find the first hit, only the second. But now this. Whipping both the, uh, the Epto and the, um, up, the forward tilt and the up tilt as well. Oh, oh yeah, that forward tilt. Yeah. So, I mean, Snake is so good in scrambles and so heavy enough to survive that up throw as well. A little bit of healing as well. Bounce as well. Just enough for it uh, not to run out of MP completely. Snake is a heavy man. I've Snake been is, saying this. He has a dozen pockets, and all of them are filled with They're very, all. very, <laughs> uh, an innumerable amount of grenades. <laughs> It weighs him down. He will not die whatsoever. We have yeah. a Celerado bringing you back so safely. And this might take it. No, okay, great. It gently lays you down. What's so hilarious is that we see Vivi. Like, they're trying to mix. They're trying to, like, I'm going to land in front of you and you'll panic, maybe spot dodge. And nobody knows has consistently selected the correct option. Yes. It's like, oh, you're going to land in front of me? I will grab you. Oh, you're and trying to, like, dash back? I will dash attack. <laughs> <laughs> no mix allowed. <laughs> Stick Ooh. to the game plan. Interesting. Uh, uh, yeah, I, I think Vivi just, just threw the Kaboom the wrong way. It went to the right side of the stage, rather where uh, nobody would knows was. So that's a, that's that's about 36 MP just lost uh, from misdirection. That's a big old. That's a lot of resources to lose yeah. all of a sudden. So right, thankfully MP does come back every time you hit, or once uh, one MP per second. So we are BB back at, back at 33, uh, 33 MP and counting 42, and we got bounce activated to avoid all these projectiles that nobody knows is throwing out, and you are not going to be challenging this nature recovery like that. It's a tight matchup thus far, though jumping over the C4, nobody knows taking their time with selection, but the Rekkas forward to one two after the accelerado. And oomphed, that's up. Like, oomphed up, pivot cancel forward tilt. One, two, goodbye, so long, farewell, and we'll see you next game. Because Vivi, look at the just dominance over the ground and 
finally nobody knows was like, oh, I'm going to put myself in the corner. I'm going to react to all this. Is that shield poke? See you in a second. Let's take a gander. Let's take a look. One, One. frame by frame. Frame. Oh, no, they dropped shield. It's simply a drop. Yeah. Probably they, didn't think. Probably just thought the first hit was done. Probably gonna, was gonna react, yeah. like react with an up tilt, and just to get the kill or something. Yeah, just like and drop shield, frame six, up tilt, drop shield, frame four, forward tilt, like something. Don't oh, forget the, F tilt is two moves, everybody. It oh, is yeah. two moves, and you can delay as well. Yes. And I believe the shield bash portion um, negates projectiles as well. Yes, it is still the shield, I believe. Yep. Um, so, so nobody knows going over to Rob. Hello. Okay. So that's our possible second Rob. Of the top eight. <laughs> and you know, like of all things, like pretty good character to pick up as a secondary. Sometimes, uh, sometimes Snake can struggle in, with characters that uh, can be like Hero, where they gain access to a whole. They can become stronger as you set up your traps yeah. and find buffs to ignore said traps. So. Pivoting over to Rob, who can be a little bit more in your face, a little bit more like deal with my down tilt, deal with my stuff now, is a much more is much more dangerous. Yeah, and just seeing it right now, VB has really had a chance to pull the menu as often as they did in the first game. For that, so a lot of that went from that psych up, you know, all they've really been able to do is use their base moves. No menu pulls, and uh, nobody knows no says They have to be able to be in VB's face as much as they can. Once you're like, going to that B menu, you are. <laughs> Nice connection to Gyro with the laser. Nice. That, yeah, some very clean gyro play. Getting like Z drop gyro forward air in order to set up laser gyro. Oh, but that's gonna work you. That's kaboom. Yeah. And Kaboom. here's the time that DB needs. Yes. You get bounce online, you shut down the laser, you shut down the gyro, have a chance to pull up menu a little bit more, get 10 mana back from that neutral air. Mm -hmm. And just dominate the ground here. It's something that BB has been doing very, very well. Like, y yes, you're going to be jumping. It's Smash Ultimate. You jump. Yeah, of course. You but jump. by committing to a lot more ground play, by pulling up menu, by poking with these uh, rising anti or uh, sometimes anti airing jabs, having access to the frizz line and hovering over Kaboom, you're keeping things horizontal. And by keeping things horizontal, nobody knows it's more often been inclined to approach with those down tilts or approach with something like forward air. And as long as you keep things in a predictable manner, then you can start changing up with like those accelerados. So then you can start messing with the dynamic a little bit. And I think that's something that Hero does best. Uh, you're absolutely right. I was getting really focused on this game. Oh, yeah. I was trying to I see saw you. Hero main out like, here is like, oh my, the game plan. I was getting scared because like I said, this is not a typical fun matchup for a hero whatsoever. And of course you have balance, but like you said, Rob is a pummel character. He is in your face. And what we like to do as hero is keep you away with Zapple and fish for menu for our buffs. Because that's what we need against you as Rob, who is uh, bigger, slower, stronger than us. And just like that, just a, just a man right there, just taking BB's second stock. And uh, Nobody Knows is chilling at 145, not getting his news, uh, thankfully, but getting the up tilt instead, flying into an even game. We have Bounce active once more, and uh, and Accelerado as well. And uh, we're going to be fishing for menu as often as we can, uh, even just the little ones we can. Sizzle, Grave sniping to a very fast uh, horizontal projectile. And uh, what I'm thinking, what I'm wishing people would kind of do a little bit more is, um, is fishing menu, but as a bait to make Nobody Knows come towards them, and then Cancel out menu with um, with uh, F tilt or um, or down tilt. Get uh, get a little bit more experimental with some of their menu play or with some of their gameplay in general because right now they oh they've been gosh. hunted out time and time again as nobody knows almost finds a combo a uh, set up all of that down smash. Relatively even right now, though, VB a little bit low on mana, but still in the manageable range. Needs to find a couple hits, though, to refresh that pool. But they're just being kept away by this gyro. Good getup attack, and the Accelerado is back online. Yeah. With that fair connected, there it and is. Accelerado keeps that, it alive. That chasing uh, fair is what VB is well known for. And we saw Ash earlier. Uh, nobody knows he's trying to recover very high, just very similar to how Dill does. And Vivi was able to double jump and match that height very easily with a Celeron active. That's the scary thing about Celeron. People forget that it, it, it's basically Shulk speed and jump together. Yeah, you know, blended. your jump is higher. You, you, uh, the only unfortunate thing about um, Celerado is you do fall faster, way faster. If you're knocked into a blast zone and you aren't reacting in time, you're going to go into a blast zone and die. 
But Vivi played this match up very, very calmly. You know, double jump in, uh, just into the fair, catching that slow recovery off of Rob. Shout out to Nobody Knows, though, member of uh, one of the many members of the Grunt Gang. Yeah, good who are, uh, I mean, it, able to make it to top six is no slouch, especially in a summer zenith.